The Gulf of Thailand is one of the Earth's richest sources of seafood, supplying consumers worldwide. The Gulf's warm, shallow waters are plied by large commercial fishing vessels, as well as providing much needed work for thousands of small fishers in the region, many using 10 to 30 ton fishing boats, as well as artisanal fishers in smaller vessels. Fishing is a notoriously dangerous occupation, with much of the labor coming from low-wage migrant labor, often trafficked or brought on vessels illegally. This vulnerable population often works under conditions meeting the international definition of forced labor or near-slave conditions as they work for months or even years at sea with high risk of disease, injury, and even death. Thai legislation passed in 2015 mandated the use of Vessel Monitoring Systems, or VMS, for vessels of 30 gross tons and above. San Francisco-based Pelagic Data Systems offers a low-cost, cell-based, lightweight, solar-powered device that reports vessel locations 600 times an hour compared to VMS's once or twice. This granular tracking allows fishers to prove where the seafood was caught and the gear type used. Additionally, hole temperature can be verified as properly iced catch can bring a premium at port as risk of spoilage is minimized and fuel consumption against fishing effort can be tracked. In the seacoast town of Ampho Kuriburi, 150 miles south of Bangkok, Pia describes to representatives of MAST, the multi-stakeholder initiative for accountable supply chain of Thai fisheries, how he is leading the way among small fishers in his community to meet consumers' demands for fresh, clean, and sustainable seafood. Recognized for his innovative approach, Pia describes his commitment to sustainable fishing and his goal of moving all artisanal fishers to adopt fresh, clean, and sustainable as their promise to the consumer. Pia's influence extends far beyond his community as he sits on an advisory panel for the Thai National Fisheries Advisory Committee and his voice is persuading others to follow his example. During the visit, Pia was proud to display his seven-point code of conduct adhered to by Khan Talay, as his local fishing cooperative is known. The code demonstrates their strong commitment to responsible fishing and is on exhibit when they take their catch to market in Bangkok on the second Saturday and Sundays of the month. At market, Pia and other Kantalei fishers educate shoppers about their community's effort to foster sustainability from the abundance of the Thai Sea. Pia also offers fishers in his community access to his freezers for their catch, but that freezer space comes at a price. Fishers agreed to package their fish with no extra water or chemical additives as the catch is frozen to ensure a fresh, clean product for consumers at a fair weight and, this is key for Pia, a commitment that fishers bring to his backyard aerated cement ponds any pregnant blue swimming crab or juvenile fish to be raised until ready for release. This is a stepping stone for Pia to truly sustainable fishing. Pia's efforts in Thailand are not alone, but they demonstrate what one man's commitment in one community can contribute to sustainable fishing worldwide. Among MAST, several objectives is to install PDS tracking systems in as many fishing vessels as possible, enabling Thai fishers to document their practices and offer the consumer the quality assurances they deserve in working with Pelagic to use its tracking system to put an end to IUU fishing and slavery at sea. And with partners like Pia, Mass continues to promote sustainable and ethical seafood worldwide.